Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy Breath XVS. Today, Kumi have released the new banner, CG Fakra. She is a healer. She is a part of a six paladin that we have. You know, the fire volitas, water volitas, fire, you know, dark volitas and stuff. She is the water volitas, guys. So basically, she is one of the, you know, top tier healer in the game because as seven star, we only have currently have two that good one is one is Ayaka one is CG Fina do you want Fokla? let's have a look guys anyway uh, it's a step up someone with five time rate up this only cost you 10k so basically you might have to sh you might get a chance to get like one of her in here and from the look of her skill and ability I found out that even she is 6 star, she is decent, she is usable. With Ayaka and CG Fina, it's the same thing guys. You only need one at 6 star, they can do the job. Some people tell me, hey man, hey X, I got like a CG um, Fina and she can do the job at 6 star, even the content today. She can heal everyone to full, she can re-rise and everything. Same thing with Flocka guys. Okay, so let's have a look at her super Tima. It's a stuff, it's nice. But this is the master, not really guys. 166, nothing special, just high spirit. Um, next is her TMR is MP Spirit 30% and Limit Burst Fill Rate by 50% and MP Heal every turn maybe like 5-10% it's nothing special as well same thing with you know um, Ayaka not much okay next in the banner is a uh, Ubo this one is interesting guys especially his um, TMR the Black Sugar Bowl Okay, it boosts attack by 40% top tier, top tier for 4 star and boosts physical damage again plan. So this is good for like mm, beginner player or mid game player when you do the um, the boss event when you fight Marlboro. If you have problem fighting Marlboro, this is this is godlike guys, 50% increase in damage and but however so you can, can only equip one and you put a plan killer plus you are collector with Pisco will most likely hit you know very hard on the plan. Okay, next um this one is kind of like not much interesting to me is accessory with spirit forty five, and um this guy is a monk. He's really cool. He look like um you know Ken in Street Fighter. He have a fist weapon with one two five water element. All right, so uh, this guy is not interesting. This this one is the one you're looking for. Maybe he is the star of the banner. If you, if you try to farm a TMR, if you don't try to farm a TMR, you can skip this banner totally. Except if you need a healer, guys. If you need a healer, okay. Let's go to Japan real quick and see what kind of stuff she bring to the game. Okay, so I have one uh, Frogger here, or oh, it's only a uh, six star. Okay. Um, the skill that I have looked, nothing interesting, but there's only like couple skill that is good as 6 star, it's single target MP, what, 210 MP, and she can double cast, and I think double cast is on 6 star as well, so basically she can cast everything as 6 star with do cast ability, okay? Um, and she can heal and MP heal over time, this is her core ability. Okay, at 7 star, not much, you know, excitement, you get 20% physical, magic, and both physical and magic damage reduction, okay, they are separate, and they are all available in first turn, except this one, it's all avail available on 5th turn, and have 1 turn cooldown, guys, so basically you cast 1, and you need, you, you have to skip 1 turn, and you do something else, okay, but I believe you can do cast this, right, so it's, um, Something God, uh, something God. No, you cannot ca do cast the cooldown ability with normal ability. Okay, so but but in my opinion, um, this is her core. She can use magic, right? With Kuruja. Kuruja is the best healing skill with Ayaka and CG Fina at seven star. I still use them. So basically, it's good enough at six star. And you have re-rise, which is the most important thing for a healer today. You need this one, and you need this one. The rest is just like you don't really need it. 
Um, do you have this this spell? Oh, she don't have this spell. But you can get the dispel from, um, you know, uh, Esper single target dispel. She don't have the AOE dispel. I might be wrong. Oh, and she have um, AOE break debuff removal. So it's really nice for a fight where the boss hit you really really, really hard. And you got a debuff and she can kill all this. So basically, she don't have a do-cast ability. Nope, she don't have it. So you have to put, um, you know, do-cast on her, which is fine. We, we can get that easily. Okay, if you play for like quite a while, you should be able to um, have do-cast already. You can buy from King Mock in the past. But if you're a new player, you have to do do-cast it. Or you get the stuff. You know, when you do a um, 10 man try, you can get the stuff. And when she get enchant, it will be next year, guys. So don't looking forward to it, but it's really, really good. She can heal, she can uh, increase resistance to break, to stop. Really, really nice. And it's five turn, uh, five turn as well. It's really nice, guys. And her limit burst is AOE 100% heal, AOE crew everything, AOE remove everything, remove break charm stop debuff wow this is excellent guys i didn't see this it's a charm and stop wow this is really really nice okay and um aoe 100 water resistant don't mind that much but this too is godlike guys but can she do she have protection from uh stop and charm as a passive no let's have a look no stop, no sham. Okay, she don't have it. So, what happened if she can stop and sham and she cannot heal anyone? <laughs> I may be wrong, guys. I might because uh, there's a lot of text here. Cannot read them all. But um, last I check, um, oh, she have Dukas ability. I apologize, guys. Okay, white magic Dukas. Yeah, she, it's a must have. She have it. So at six stars, well, apologize, apologize. So oh, well, yeah, very good healer, guys. It's top tier healer because we only have three. That's a good one, okay? So yeah, it's good. But the thing is, you can cast this a uh, stop resistant here for five for five turns. So you kind of don't really need it. Her limit burst right here, stop resistant. Okay, um, charm resistant. Yes, she have everything. So basically, don't really need that. But basically, your team will immune to everything. Okay, so yeah, I think it's, that's it for CG Frogger. And um, some people ask me, when is Arkstar coming out? Let's have a look, guys. Arkstar, Arkstar, the one that everyone looking for, especially me. I'm looking for Arkstar in global very really much i am i kind of want him in my team so right now we have um cg seatheart he's the best tank in the game um just uh we had that last week and um Flocka is here so basically guys it's 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 get to the, the fun part now i believe this month nothing excitement going on because we have a yoshida yoshida so a, a healer and a buffer as well and um, quite a decent one, really good one, but uh, she hurt him herself when she do that, but she can heal her back, back up to normal. And two of the Onion Knight and Dark Knight, like Lynette or something. So this two is really cute, but I shake that kid, it's not that interesting. But guys, I believe next month is Jade and Aaron. Ah, uh, this two kick butt, guys. If you don't have any good damage dealer, if you're free to play, you may have ticket. Like I said, like two or three months ago, keep your ticket for this two. This two will come out at the same time, okay? Maybe uh, this this week is this guy. Maybe next week this two. Maybe we have a uh, some limited edition. This month maybe Sino Gear. Maybe next week. I don't know. Maybe next month. It should be interesting. Or maybe Frivius Aurora Frivius. Oh, she's that good as well. But uh, if she come out, I mean, mean this two not sell. So. Hmm, I think maybe Sinokia will come out this, this month, okay? Or maybe next month and, uh, and Aurora Fire as well, okay? Maybe in February, I, I don't know, man. That's my prediction. But this Jade is so cool, man. Let's look at him. He's like um, Winter Soldier, okay? With a big sword. Excellent design. I love him. 
and it's a uh, tight dust chaining family and he to do a ton of damage and you don't if you don't have any good breaker Aaron is here as well so if you don't have a Lawrence you can get him and he's look quite nice as well this this two design look you know really good like like a like a boss tier collector you know um, maybe next month we will get um, fire volitas this guy okay and uh, what is it January February March is um jumping volitas April we will get like um, this guy got go uh, got go bed or something and Wait, January, January, February, March, April. Whoa, is that fast? January, February, March, April. Maybe we might get it in three months, guys, for Asta. Oh, should you keep the ticket? Man, if, I had, if you don't have any good damage, the only I go for Jade, man. I don't know, I love Jade. I fanboy Jade, okay? Um, and then we have like two months. Or three months left so you keep all the tickets you should have like because every month Gumi keep like 40 ticket or 50 I don't know man let's say 50 with all the um, you do daily you do Explorer you do arena you should get like a lot of lapis and a uh, ticket you should have by in four months you should have like 200 ticket if you don't spend on anything just keep the ticket on Axstar guys so you can get two two of him and um, you need a choice if you still have it you get one and you use ticket you try to get for one then you should get Axta and Sack it will come out really soon and Sack is top tier in, in Japan for the best finisher in the game okay the best finisher in the game even better than Clown today Kingdom Heart Clown is Sack kick his ass okay and uh, the best in Japan today I check is still CG Lightning guys not that far apart maybe it's like six months no it's, it's, it's quite far seven months like eight months nine months away so not looking for lightning yet she's she's very strong guys okay so yeah that's it for me today on um cg fucker and let's have a look at this before we go all right guys anyway guys you guys have a good day and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.